This is John P. Welcome to Geek Beat. Today we're going to do a real world test of the Red Rock Micro Cobalt Cage. Stay tuned. Okay guys, so we're on our big cross country trip to New York and uh, we figured this was a perfect time to try out the new Cobalt Cage from Red Rock Micro. Um, it's a little aluminum cage that's designed specifically to mount GoPro, Hero 2, or Hero 3 cameras so that you can use them for really, really rugged applications. Because, you know, let's face it, the little plastic things that they normally come with, not so durable. However, when you mount it in a cobalt cage, you get what's going on right up here in the front. As you can see, we've got one mounted on the front of the truck here. It's on a little arm that has three heavy-duty suction cup mounts. It's staring at us, and it is filming right now. So we can take a look at what that looks like. But we're also going to give a, uh, a little test to that cobalt cage and see how it can do under more demanding circumstances. All right, one of the other cool things about the Red Rock Micro uh, Cobalt Cage here is all of the different mounting points. As you can see, we put a quick disconnect on one of these, but we could put it in any of these holes. There are more on the sides, on the top. They're all over the place. And this particular model is made to accommodate the Hero 2 in its cage. So I loosen up this little part right here and this thing just slides right out and then you put it back in like so drop it in here slide this down there we go nice and secure so the real question is not whether we can put mounts all over it so you can hang it off a card or hang it off the side the question is how durable is the cage so let's find out I figure this ought to do it Norm what do you think oh yeah Did it make it? Yeah, lifted up the whole trailer. Yeah, it made it. We got we got a few little, maybe lost a little anodizing finish on there. Uh, let's see if the GoPro still works. Yep, that still works. So, uh, test number one, I'd say that's a success. Uh, I wonder what would happen if at high speeds we were it were to come flying off of its mounts on the vehicle. Shall we find out? Here we go. The GoPro stayed in it. The clamp came a little loose. Maybe I just didn't have it tight, en tight enough at first. We got some scratches on the edges, some yellow paint mark. Uh, maybe picked up one little scratch on the lens of the cover for the GoPro, but that's the good thing about this particular cage. You can put it in inside the case, so it's got two forms of protection. But as you can see, it's still rolling, although now it says no SD. Probably the SD card popped out in there. I would say it passes with flying colors. So, uh, I don't know. You guys head out, get yourself a Red Rock Micro Cobalt cage. And as for me, I've got a few more important things to see and do. See you later.